an unexpected move, opening the way for French prosecutors to fully investigate claims of sexual molestation against the Vatican's ambassador to France. In a statement, the Vatican called it an extraordinary gesture, which confirmed the ambassador's will to fully cooperate with the French judicial authorities. Archbishop Luigi Ventura is accused of groping several young men. In January, one of his accusers, Mathieu de la Souchère, filed a police report against the Vatican envoy for inappropriately touching him during an event at Paris City Hall. Last week, de la Souchère went to the Vatican with his lawyer to meet one of Pope Francis' sex abuse advisers. The Vatican claimed its envoy was cooperating, but his accuser's lawyer insisted that the probe had been stalled because of Ventura's diplomatic immunity. What is extremely shocking in this story is that, in fact, diplomatic immunity, whether jurisdictional or personal, is not intended to aid someone's work as an ambassador. Its purpose to protect an ambassador from any pressure from the whole state. The Vatican's ambassador has refused to comment on the allegations. Around the world, the Catholic Church is struggling to regain its standing following a series of sex abuse scandals.